for Elevator Think in the channel where we speak about astrology, spirituality, philosophy. And I finally made a website. So if you want to check it out, it's in the description box below. And if you want to get a Vedic Astrology Consultation, yes, it's right there. It's in the website. And if you want it, I'm going to read your chart. I'm going to make it happen. Just make sure you go down there in the description box, go to the website, and follow the instructions. That's it. Simple as that. Now let's speak about personality qualities of the sign of Scorpio. Because before we even dive deeper into astrology about all the planets and how they act in signs, you need to know just the basic, which is what the sign signifies. We just strip in astrology to the very easily format. Because Mercury and Scorpio is different than Venus and Scorpio. Okay, so you just gotta understand what is Scorpio. And Scorpio is a water sign. But, and water signs are all about emotions, intuition, feelings. But Scorpio is a bit different. Because Cancer, so, so water sign is an emotion sign, it's a soft sign. It's that motherly nourishment it's about taking care. Whereas Pisces is all about spirituality, that calm water, the most soothing water. Where Scorpio is the most intense, it's the deepest water. It's like imagine the ocean just, just going straight down. You can imagine how black it gets. That's Scorpio. Scorpio is about sudden change, sudden event. Like from one moment, you're poor, the next you're rich, and then from rich, poor, and then poor, rich again. It's just this up and down roller coaster. You, you don't know what to expect with Scorpio. Scorpio, imagine Scorpio as just this dark, gloomy energy. And they become very intense into anything they are involved in because see Scorpio is controlled by the sign of Mars and picture Mars as a soldier so Mars is your energy Mars is a soldier and a soldier can't be afraid of death scenarios Scorpio is about death and rebirth so certain planets in the sign of Scorpio will feel like, oh my God, my life is ending. But other planets will become very courageous because they've been through the darkness and they can fight through it. But certain planets will just feel burdened. And from all the 12 zodiac signs, Scorpio is the most chaotic, chaotic, but yet it makes one of the strongest people because if you seen the darkness, if you've been through the dark, if you've been in the rock bottom, you've seen all the ugly, you're not afraid, you become fearless. You, you just become a military man, soldier minded. That all right, I've been through the dark. Now, I, nothing can fear me. No matter what happens, no matter what transformation I may go through, I will still persevere. I will still continue. Because Scorpio is a fixed sign. That's the funny thing about it. Scorpio, when they do something, when they take action towards something, when they believe in something, when they strive for something, they're fixed on it. And fixed signs are like, this is it, this is the way it's gotta be. And this is, there's no more, there's no options to. That's what fixed sign means. 
But the thing is, they run in a situation where things change. And Scorpio want to keep that fixed energy, and that's where the trouble comes in. That's why Scorpio feels turbulent. Because they're fixed. They're, they're just trying to hold that. But the thing is, by holding it, things start changing automatically. And that's where the chaotic energy of Scorpio. And it's a scorpion. So they have that tail. So if you try to come at a Scorpio, a person who could possess a lot of Scorpio energy, they will come after you intensely. Intensely, they will come after you. And they will aim straight to your emotions. So Scorpio is about the darkness. And it's about the light at the same time. Coming together and persevering through the changes and evolving. Scorpio will always change a person. Okay? Astrology for Elevate Your Thinking. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe for much more video of astrology, spirituality, and philosophy. The movement is just getting started. So let's do this together, right? Peace out. Love ya. Let's go.